Sentence is a one liner writing competition. Two comics, five rounds. Who wins? You decide. Vote for the winner at the end of the show. Now, please welcome your host, Brianna. Everybody and welcome to Death Sentence, the first and only one-liner online comedy writing competition show thing, probably. I am your host, Brianna, and this week we got a fun episode of The Dueling Dorks. Coming all the way from Oakland, California is Gary Hughes, and going up against him is the heavy lifter himself from Sioux Falls, South Dakota, Ian Ryland Smith. Hell fucking yeah, you guys. I love doing this show because they send me, you know, really encouraging messages like this one. I'm not good at one-liners. Isn't that fucking reassuring? I'm so excited, you guys. All right, you know the comics, you know the rules, so let's kick things off with round one. Snitching. When is a snitch also a snake? When they got a tattletale. Like a rattletale, snake, snitch. All right, snitching. Whistleblowers tell on people. Cockblowers inhale people. It's very true. What do you get when notorious tattletale Takashi69 picks up sewing? Snitches get stitches. What the fuck? All right, you guys, it doesn't matter if it's a one-liner or a fun fact, as long as it's very true. All right, I don't know. We're just going to move on to round two. Nature is a forest fire that big of a deal if all the trees burn down? Seems a little plain to me. All right, nature, you guys, whatever. Having sex in the woods is pleasant, especially... If you're going down on a vegan because it's just biodegradable. Some say nature is the best, but I think there are better granola bars. Oh boy, vegans and Nature Valley granola bars. The only thing that those things have in common is I don't want them near my crotch. A lot of crumbs. All right. (laughs) We're going to move on to round three the female orgasm. The female orgasm is like the fountain of youth. It's not piss, and Ponce de Leon died trying to find it. It's not piss! Okay, the female orgasm. The female orgasm is kind of like Pluto. It's very far to reach, and to many of us, it is non-existent. It's very true. I failed to please my woman. Now I need a new electric toothbrush. All right, uh, no one is surprised by Gary's, and you know, I don't know, at least Ian's toothbrush is getting some kind of use. But all right, let's just move this show right along into round four. Books. I exercise my mind with books. They make great paperweights. <laughs> Books. What do you call a wizard who cannot read? Tome deaf. It's very true. I'm sick of the novel coronavirus. I just want the movie to come out already. God, all right. <laughs> no, that was that was a pretty solid round. Good job, you guys. All right. <clears throat> this is that point of the show where I remind you guys that at the very end of this program, all 
probably 18 seconds of it, there's going to be a poll in my Instagram story at not a damn cheese. That is where you go to vote for who you think the winner should be. So with that being said, let's move it right along to the final round. Chinese food. I lost my job as an electrician at the Chinese restaurant because when it came to the light bulbs, I dim some, I lose some. Okay, at least it wasn't racist. All right, Chinese food. I like to walk my Chinese food before I eat it. Bruh. Maybe take it to the dog park or something. Yikes. What do you get when you fight with Bruce Lee's son, Brock? Beef with Brock Lee. Oh boy, they had me in the first half, not gonna lie. But you know, broccoli, beef with broccoli really came through. That shit fucking tickled me. Much like actual beef with broccoli. If it's spicy, tickles my butthole a little bit. Real nice. All right, anyway. <laughs> thank you so much, Gary and Ian, for being on the show. We are at the very end where now you, the watchers, must head on over to my Instagram at not a damn cheese and go to the story, the Instagram story, and vote in the poll for who you think won, Gary or Ian. And we will be back next week here Wednesday at A on YouTube and Instagram with another episode of Death Sentence. My name is Brianna and I'm getting the fuck out of here. Bye!